Welcome to CNAV Marine. Today's topic is marine communication. Marine communication plays a crucial role in ensuring the safety and efficient operation of vessels at sea. Here's a brief explanation of each product. EPIRB, Emergency Position Indicating Radio Beacon. A device that transmits a distress signal on 406 MHz to satellites and 121.5 MHz to aircrafts and nearby vessels. EPIRB installed on a ship must have the internal AIS frequency along with the 406 MHz channel and the GNSS receiver. SART, Search and Rescue Transponder. A device that transmits a response signal on 9 GHz when interrogated by a radar. There are two types of SART, Radar SART and AIS SART. VHF DSC radios, radios that transmit and receive voice and data messages on VHF channels. They use line of sight propagation. It is coming in fixed and portable type. Further fixed radios are of two type class A VHF which meets EMO and SOLAS requirement. Second type of fixed radio is class D which can be used in small boat, yacht where there is no regulation come in play. Portable VHF are of four type, normal radio, GMDSS radio, intrinsically safe radio and ATEX. GMDSS Global Maritime Distress and Safety System. A system that provides various communication methods for distress, urgency, safety and routine messages. It uses different frequencies and propagation types depending on the equipment and service provider. MFHF SSB radios, medium frequency and high frequency, it's also called single sideband radios. Radios that transmit and receive voice and data messages on HF and MF bands using single sideband modulation. They use ground wave and ionospheric propagation. NBDP stands for narrow band direct printing, which is a technique for digital communication using MFHF radio frequencies. NBDP allows ships to send and receive telex messages with shore stations and other ships. An NBDP interface is a device that connects the MF-HF radio equipment with a printer or a computer terminal that can display the telex messages. Inmarsat C is a global maritime communication system that uses geostationary satellites to send and receive text messages, emails, distress alerts, and safety information between ships and shore stations. It operates on a store and forward technique that ensures reliable data transmission. LRIT, Long Range Identification and Tracking. A system that collects and transmits the identity, position and date slash time of vessels to authorized recipients. Flag Authority pulls data from vessel through LRIT terminal. It can be integrated within Marsat C or can be installed standalone as well. SSAS is a system that enables a ship to send a secret alert to selected authorities, such as the ship manager, owner, or coast guard. In the event of a security threat, the alert is transmitted via satellite communication and can be integrated within Marsat C or installed as a standalone system. SAS has two alert buttons that should be hidden from view. One button should be located on the bridge near the GMDSS table and the other button should be in the captain's cabin. By pressing either button, the ship can activate the SAS and notify the authorities of its identity and location. Navtex, Navigational Telex. A service that broadcasts maritime safety information on MF frequencies. It uses ground wave propagation. Fleet Broadband, a satellite communication service that provides voice and broadband data connectivity. VSAT, Very Small Aperture Terminal. A satellite communication system that uses small antennas to access geostationary or low Earth orbit satellites. It uses line of sight propagation. Satellite TV, a television service that broadcasts signals from satellites to receivers on board vessels. It uses line of sight propagation to geostationary satellites. PABX, private automatic branch exchange. A telephone system that connects internal extensions to external lines. It uses wireline or wireless communication depending on the equipment. Public address, a system that amplifies and distributes voice announcements to speakers throughout the vessel. It uses wireline or wireless communication depending on the equipment. Talkback systems, a system that allows two-way voice communication between different locations on board the vessel. 
It uses wireline or wireless communication depending on the equipment. Sound Power Telephone, a telephone system that does not require any external power source and operates by converting sound waves into electrical signals. It uses wireline communication. At CNAV Marine, we value your dedication, passion and professionalism. We encourage you to study, work smartly and grow in your career. We are always there with you to support, guide and empower you to work independently and creatively. We also expect you to follow discipline and maintain a clean and safe work environment. Together, we can achieve excellence and success in the marine industry. Thank you for being part of our team.